tip number one for overwhelm. If you're feeling overwhelmed, it be is because you have too much information that has not been categorized properly. So it's just a big mushmash in your brain and it causes anxiety and a uh, lack of clarity of what the heck to do. So if that's something that you suffer with and you feel and even use those words in your head, oh my gosh, I'm so overwhelmed, I can't get through this. First of all, we're gonna start by changing that and not using the words, I am overwhelmed. Just put it to the side and say, I've got this. Um, and then the second part of that is that you really need to create a plan and a structure for the day of what's important. Once you've prioritized all that you have to do, then you can go about your day with clarity and focus and not feel overwhelmed. Um, it may take a little bit of practice, but I promise you, you can get through it. It's when you have a moment in the day where you're doing one thing, but you think you should be doing three other things, that gives you that awful sense of like, not accomplishing things and being overwhelmed. But if you will start your day with a very clear and precise plan of everything that you need to do, prioritize, put it on the schedule as to the best time to get that done, and then mark off everything else that somebody else can do for you, that's somebody else's job, that's somebody else's laundry. Start looking at things that you can get off of your plate so that you can hit each one of the things that you need to do with clarity and purpose and there's no more overwhelm because you are driving, you are running the show, and you are in control over your priorities. You can get it done. At the end of the day, you're like, got it, done. And take a deep breath, start over again the next day.